Uh, before I hand the mic to Mr. Walter, um, I'd like to let you know that Nate's grandfather has a fishing rod over here for raffle, and it's especially made in Nate's honor. It has uh, Wilmot High School on it. It has in memory of Nate Walter um, engraved on it. It's very, quite beautiful. So please check that out. It's over toward the front here. Um, it would be an honor to own that. So without further ado, here's Mr. Walter. Maybe take a moment, help me recognize Mrs. Carlisle and uh, Wilma High School for putting this on. We really appreciate it. It's a lot. So we're excited this year with the scholarship fund. My wife and I were talking about this. Um, the support we've received from the community has just been overwhelming over the last year or so. Um, and the scholarship feels like a great way to give back to the community, so we want to thank you all for supporting that. We're very excited about the scholarship fund, and uh, hopefully we can um, help somebody further their education after the moment. So, thank you again very much, and we'll pass it off to somebody over here to tell us what to do for the run. <laughs> As Mrs. Carlisle and Mr. Walter both stated, it is great to see everybody out here. Um, and uh, my job is to explain the uh, five kilometer run. Um, just let you know I've already ran it four times today, so you should be able to go that way. Um, or at least the gator that I'll be trying to get four times today. Um, if you were out here last year, it is pretty much the same course. You will start out on the track on that corner, and you'll literally make a loop around the stadium and out. Um, there will be cones on the course. There are NHS members and key club members who will be out on the course directing traffic. But basically, if you see some cones, it means you've got to turn. Um, there are a couple of sets where there will be cones on both sides. Go through them. If you see cones going around, just basically follow the cones. Um, but the key is, see the people in front of you and you shouldn't get lost. If you don't want to go all 5K and would rather go three kilometers, you are more than welcome to do that. Once you, once you get out onto the fairgrounds, basically as you enter the fairgrounds by the old Wilmot grade school, literally hang a left and just walk right back down that path straight ahead and you'll come right back out and it'll cut out the two kilometers that are out on the, out on the fairgrounds. So that'll be that way. Couple other things, it is a little rough around, you'll go around the racetrack out there, and it is all dirt, and it is all, it, there's mud tracks and everything else. So, Mrs. Hegman's boy is ready to lead the race. Uh, so, runners first, if you were planning on running, I would suggest you guys come out first and head to that corner over there. I will get the gator and lead the way. Let's go. Like, I don't want to leave. Get lost. I thought you don't want to leave. 